All right, so we got done with our second session of the day. Pretty good, but still just super grippy in the car. Really struggling between grip and sliding in the wet. So, uh, but now we're gonna do a competition driver's uh, meeting. So, here we are. We go to, we've got our rear clip number one, our rear touch and go, right on this inside island. You're gonna just hit there with the rear of the car, come around, we don't have anything right here. Oh, I got a really low number. <laughs> I got really, I got a really high one. I'm like, uh, uh. <laughs> that means I'm probably gonna get the lead. There's three. Thought I had one. The robber. <laughs> Slowly sneak it out. <laughs>
Moving on to the next round is Alex Anonovich. All right, so we just got done with the full day of drifting, day two of drifting. I am tired. I think the car is tired, but it performed beautifully all day today. I was still struggling with the power, but Austin had a brainwave moment. So I'm starting to think now is that the engine actually feels really good, especially with the throttle position sensor we put in, the oxygen sensor, and having the ports open. What I've noticed now though is that we can keep up with some bigger horsepower guys like we see in the wet and the dry almost. And I'm starting to wonder now if it's a grip thing in the rear. We put the 16s on and it wasn't totally a, a totally crazy difference, but there was a difference in just more give. And these Falcon tires are amazing. Like after just running them all day, they've barely been chewed up, especially being in the wet. Uh, these things have lasted the whole event and they are doing fantastic. So are the new tires that I put on the front. Having some problems with the lipping on here, so I had to roll this fender today you know, with the good old wrench and then uh, raise the height. But other than that, now it's just gonna be more practice, more figuring out the line, because tomorrow we're doing the new limited series where they actually cut the course, and I've got a picture of that. Uh, we just went to driver's meeting for that. Um, we will also have a driver's meeting tomorrow for the limited. This is just kind of an introduction to it. This is really cringe, but I've got people like back there staring at me doing this. Sorry. It's always I'm cringe. Sorry. It's always cringe. So we're gonna call so we're gonna go to bed today and come back early in the morning tomorrow, go to church, and I need to go to bed. I thought in that situation I'd pucker my butt, but I didn't. Hey Brisbane, Wesley Nagel, Kaylee Nelson, Chris Paulson. Is there a name I did not call that's doing the limited? Maximum tire, 300 tread wear minimum. Every anything higher tread wear on lower sizes fine. Now we're checking all that. We I'll be helping get you guys lined up properly, and we're going to keep carrying on as quickly as we can to make sure this moves along. All right, guys, it's Sunday. We're back at the track, and it's time for comp. I did a few runs, super crazy, super hectic. I got to get over there right away. 
I have the suit on and it feels amazing. It's actually really breathable, which I'm surprised by. It's not too hot. So we're gonna go ahead, jump in the car and get some runs done. Okay. All right, we've got Alex back up the line, and our winner moving on to the next round is Adrian Wanted. Thank you, man. Good, good lead. <laughs> nice.
Is it bad? I got the rear bass bar. <laughs> And we got into the wall and I thought it was gonna be really bad but the rest of the car handled it really well coming around here we could see here where it uh, scraped up the wall it went up most of the dirt and then this is the only thing that scraped up against the wall and then right here's the bash bar we put in so overall definitely not bad we can actually just like bend it back with my bare hand <laughs> look at that Good as new. <laughs> but now, since we're done, it is Sunday, so it means Monday's back to work. So we're gonna go ahead, get the car all loaded up, back ready to go, and we're gonna call this event officially done. I also wanna give a shout out to ND Drift for this amazing track, amazing like road surface, amazing people here. It's always a fun time being out here. Always, always an awesome event being out here. And I also gotta give a big shout out to Red Camel Racing. I'm actually surprised I'm still wearing the suit because the suit is actually really breathable even though it's black and if the sun is out, it's baking. I actually feel really cool, it feels really good. Also give a shout out to my little, my little tag ripped out. <laughs> Also a big shout out to Mijimoto. The oil coolers did an awesome job. If the car started to get a little bit warm, I just took a lap up and down the end and the car was back to operating temperature. It's absolutely perfect. Thanks again guys for your for watching and supporting and, and in the ways that you have. Lots of advice from the guys here at the track. I really appreciate it. We've got a lot of tuning to do on the car. So on the road we go.